हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल फॉर दोज ऑफ यू हु आर वॉचिंग मी फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम माई नेम इज साइल अग्रवाल आई हैव जस्ट कम्प्लीटेड माई बी टेक इन कंप्यूटर साइंस फॉर माई टी गांधी नगर आई एम ऑल्सो गोइंग टू जॉइन डी ई शॉ एज सॉफ्टवेयर डेवलपर इन अ मंथ ऑन दिस चैनल आई मेक वीडियोज रिलेटेड टू डी एस सी प्रिपरेशन इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन यू कैन कंसिडर दिस चैनल एज अ वन स्टॉप सोल्यूशन फॉर ऑल यर क्वेरीज रिगार्डिंग हाउ टू क्रैक एन इंटर्नशिप और प्लेसमेंट ऑफर फ्रॉम एनी टॉप प्रोडक्ट बेस्ड कंपनीज आई शेयर माई लर्निंग इयर आई शेयर माई एक्सपीरियंस इज इयर आई ऑल्सो प्लान टू मेक वीडियोज ऑन दी अल्टोन लाइफ ऑफ एन आई आई टी एंड विच इज हिडन फ्रॉम दी आउट साइड वर्ल्ड एज यू वुड हैव सीन इन द थम नेल एंड द टाइटल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ आई लर्न वेब डेवलपमेंट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द वेरी बेसिक्स ऑफ एच टी एम एल सी एस एस आवर स्क्रिप्ट दैन मूविंग ऑन टू दी बैक एंड पार्ट मूविंग ऑन टू दी बैक एंड फ्रेम वर्क लाइक नोट जे एस एक्सप्रेस जे एस ई जे एस दैन मूविंग ऑन टू लर्निंग अबाउट डेटा बेज इज लर्न अबाउट मॉन्गो डू बी एंड देन लर्निंग अबाउट ऑथेंटिकेशन एंड सिक्योरिटी हाउ टू हैंडल क्रेडेंशियल्स एंड हाउ टू डिजाइन अ सिक्योर लॉग इन सिस्टम एंड देन फाइनली मेक अ वेबसाइट आउट ऑफ इट लेट मी टेल यू दैट दर इज अ सरप्राइज पैकेज फॉर यू गाइज इन दिस वीडियो सो स्टे ट्यून टिल दी एंड इफ यू फाइंड दिस वीडियो हेल्पफुल do subscribe to the channel like this video share it with all your friends who are learning web development or want to start learning web development and you can comment down any queries any suggestions which you may have for me i will definitely try to reply to you now you would be thinking that how can this guy learn web development and build a website out of it in just 30 days so well, to be honest web development is not that difficult it is relatively easy as compared to other cs domains as compared to other development side like app development or even machine learning blockchain cyber security web development is relatively easier than this i took up a course from udemy which was called as complete web development boot camp and it helped me a lot so i would also advise you guys to take up a structured web development course from udemy or from any other platform which you trust because that will help you a lot in learning every concept in detail and in every good course you will find multiple projects so what will happen is that when you will learn two three concepts there will be a project based on that so not only you will learn those concepts but you will also get to apply those concepts in a real world website or an application so that you get hands on experience instead of only watching lectures i would like to point out that i read all your comments and i found that many first and second year students ask me some very common questions like how to start coding how to get a high paying job in the tech industry how to get paid internships what skills should we develop in our college how can we learn about artificial intelligence machine learning blockchain and cyber security does college degree or branch even matter i know that having these kind of questions and confusions in your mind is quite common because you are just a first year or a second year student but don't worry i'm happy to share that on this weekend IITians who got an AIR of 93, 99, and 119, and got placed at some of the biggest tech giants like Microsoft, ISRO, and Samsung are conducting a free webinar. Yes, you heard that right. It is it is a completely free webinar. You don't have to give a single penny. This webinar will be of almost one hour. It will be very beneficial for you and for your career because everyone needs to know the right path which they need to follow in order to become successful. Right. So who other than IITians can guide you in this direction properly? I have put the link of the webinar in the description i request everyone to please check it out and do register for the webinar as it is completely free and it trust me it will be super beneficial for you everything related to 4.2 technologies everything related to internships and placements everything related to how to get a high paying job in the tech industry everything related to what you should be doing in order to become successful in your career you will get everything in that webinar personally i have watched that webinar and trust me the kind of advice these guys are giving in that webinar is super beneficial and for the first year and second year students it is like a diamond so do register for the webinar the link is in the description now it's time to show the website which i made after learning web development in just 30 days so i am a gym lover and most of the people who come to the gym either want to lose weight or gain weight so the most active machine in a gym is actually a weighing machine when i joined gym my main aim was to gain weight so i thought of making a website which could track the weight of any user here is the website which i made the name of the website which i gave was weight and watch so the dashboard looks like this uh, you will have to button register and log in if you are coming on to the website for the first time you will have to register on this website so clicking on register uh, actually you will have to register using your google account so once you have registered you can now log in into your account so when you will click to log in you will log in using google account credentials uh, which will be taken from other database so whatever google account you use to register you can actually log in using that same account so here i use the knowledge of authentication and google sign in which i learned moving on after you have logged in this 
page will come up and here you can actually add weight corresponding to the particular day and then you can click on the button add data so as soon as you click on the button add data the weight for that particular day will get added to the database after that you can actually track your weight for seven days for 14 days for 28 days or for even 90 days and, and you can click on this track button and as soon as you click on this track button you will get a line chart will which will show how the progress has been so here i use the knowledge of mongodb database because as soon as you are clicking on that add data button the data is getting added to your database okay so yeah, this was the website which i made i'm not saying that this is a huge website which i have made this is a very basic website but if you see i have used everything from starting from the basics of html css javascript then i have used the back end part using Node.js, Express.js, EJS, then I have used the knowledge of MongoDB database and I've also incorporated authentication and Google sign which I learned from the course and I can present this project in the interview and say that oh see this website can actually have live users because everyone wants to track their weight and so they can use this website to track their weight so this website was something which I can also use to track my weight. So yeah, this was all about the website which I made by learning web development in just 30 days. Some very common questions that students ask is like, what domain should we build projects in? So my answer would always be that you can choose any domain, be it web development, app development, machine learning, AI, cybersecurity, blockchain. You guys also ask me that what kind of projects should we make? How do we think of unique projects? So I've just given an example of how I built a project, which I'm not saying that it is unique, but obviously it, it can add value to people's life so think of a website or an app or something which can add value to people's life that will automatically become a good project i've always stressed upon this fact that having good projects in your resume actually adds a lot of value because it helps your resume stand out from others and it increases your chances of getting shortlisted when you are applying for internships or placements at product based companies or even service based companies. The only way you can stand out your resume is by having great competitive programming achievements or by having great ratings at Codechef, Code Forces, and Lead Code, or you can actually have some very good projects which are adding value to people's life. In that way, you can stand out your resume from others. I found out that students who actually attended the webinar and listen to it carefully were actually able to build some amazing projects so these are some of the projects which students who attended the webinar made uh, so you can just see like these are some beautiful projects which they have made again i would request you guys to check out the link in the description and do register for the webinar as it is completely free and it is just a 45 minute to one webinar and the output which you will derive from that webinar will be huge so yeah this was all about the video i shared my learnings and experiences on how i learned web development and actually built a project out of it by applying everything which i learned i hope you enjoyed watching this video and gained something from this video and don't forget to register for the webinar the link is in the description you can check that out i will meet you in the next video till then keep learning keep growing and stay healthy